begun the countdown for the PSLV C-54 mission. It's all set to launch the final mission of the PSLV for the year 2022. The PSLV C-54 mission will lift off from the first launch pad at the Satish Dhawan Space Center in Sriharikota with nine satellites, which includes eight nano satellites at 11.56 a.m. today. Now, the 44.4-meter rocket will launch with a liftoff mass of uh, 321 tons with its prime primary satellite being the Earth Observation Satellite 6, also dubbed the OceanSat-3. The mission is said to be one of the longest ones undertaken by ISRO scientists. The satellite will be deployed in the Sun synchronous orbit. This means they are synchronized to always be in the same fixed position relative to the Sun. All right, uh, going straight across to my colleague, uh, uh, Dharani, who is uh, joining us uh, live on the broadcast for more, more on this. Uh, Dharani, in just a short while from now, ISRO will, of course, uh, launch the final mission of the PSLV for the year 2022. Well, uh, absolutely right. Uh, the PSLV uh, C54, uh, you know, rocket, it will be carrying nine payloads in total. Uh, so the primary payload will be US-06, which is an Earth, Earth observation satellite. Uh, so apart from that, eight other nano satellites will also be carried by uh, uh, this rocket. So uh, totally nine payloads. And you know, when you talk about the nano satellites, uh, most of uh, these, uh, you know, eight nano satellites, they are from uh, uh, private, uh, you know, space startup companies uh, uh, based in India and you know, uh, a foreign country. Uh, so, uh, totally nine payloads are, are going to be carried by this uh, PSLV C-54. Uh, so, this uh, mission is sh scheduled to be, uh, you know, uh, launched around 11.56 a.m. from uh, the Satish Dhawan Space Centre here in uh, Shrigari Kota. Uh, the launch will take place uh, from, you know, the first launch pad and, you know, around 11.56 a.m. Uh, so, when you talk about uh, the operation of this uh, uh, rocket, uh, so uh, this mission will see the primary payload, that is the EOS-06, the Earth Observation Satellite, you know, getting separated first. Uh, so, the, uh, after the separation, of uh, the EOS, uh, there will be a change in orbit, and after that, you know, uh, the rest other uh, nine uh, nano satellites, eight nano satellites, they will be deployed into a separate sun, sun synchronous uh, polar orbit. So, uh, basically, uh, this mission involves uh, not one orbit but two orbits. Uh, the first primary payload, the Earth observation satellite, that will be deployed in one orbit, and then after that, there will be a change in orbit. So, the rest eight uh, nano satellites, they will be deployed in a separate a second uh, orbit. So, this involves two orbits. Uh, so talking about uh uh, the ISRO scientists and developers uh, also since today morning uh, you know uh, hundreds of ISRO scientists and uh, developers they are present here in the, Shri, uh, the Satish Dhawan Space Center in Shrigari Kota uh, so they are doing the final rounds of uh, you know checkings and testing so after uh, which uh, you know the countdown will officially begin and uh, the launch will exactly take place as at 11.56 a.m. from uh, the first launch pad uh, so you know this is definitely going to be a very important uh, launch and you know we are also learning that uh, uh, ISRO chairman uh, Omnath. He held a, a special uh, puja at Nellur ahead of this launch. So uh, he did a special uh, puja that uh, this uh, launch, uh, this particular mission has to be successful. And moreover, uh, this uh, mission, it will take place uh, uh, for over two hours. Uh, so, you know, from the time of the launch, we'll have to wait for over two hours uh, to know if this mission is a success or not. Uh, so the total mission timing is approximately 8,200 uh, seconds, which uh, which is roughly uh, over two hours. Uh, so since, uh, you know, the launch is going to take place at 11.50, 6 a.m. We'll have to wait at least till 2 p.m. Uh, to officially confirm if the you know mission is success or not. So that is uh, uh, the time period that uh, the ISRO, uh, ISRO has you know put down. Uh, so of course everybody is very eagerly waiting for this launch and several public also, not only from the state of Andhra Pradesh but also from Karnataka and Tamil Nadu. Uh, they are you know coming here in large numbers to Shrigiri Kota to witness this uh, you know uh, last PSLV launch for this year. Right, uh, Dharani, counting down to the last uh, PSLV launch uh, this year. Many thanks for joining us with all those updates.